Secretary General of the Communications Workers Union, Clyde Elder, is concerned that TSTT will not remain in its current structure. Speaking to reporters after a meeting with the Minister of Public Utilities, Robert Lahunt, the union leader suggested it could well be that TSTT may be another Petrotrin. Ian Wayson reports. Communication Workers Union leader Clyde Elder shared concerns that TSTT will go through a transformation soon, especially after hearing what the minister had to say. His position is that he likes the Petrotrin model, and if that model serves or helps to make TSTT profitable, then he doesn't see what is wrong with that. Of course, that tells us that it is quite possible that what we know TSCT to be as it is now will not be existing for much longer. The union met with Mr. Lee Hunt after it had written to the minister in November requesting a meeting. The minister, according to Mr. Elder, said he's in support of TSTT's plan to save 1,300 jobs. But they could not see eye to eye on the process the company was taking to retrench workers. And of course we are going to challenge the process as we see fit through the normal courses that we have engaged in. In fact, we are in court right now. The workers were also concerned about a rumor circulating there was no money to pay severance at the end of the month. But Mr. Elder said all fears were put to rest. He can go on record as saying whatever has to be paid to workers in accordance with the law, that by the end of this month, they will get it. During the meeting, both parties agreed TSCT needed to operate differently to ensure its survival. The minister also encouraged the union to bring any reports of wrongdoing by TSCT to him. Ian Wayson, TTT News.